Hello, this is my setup for Deus Ex, um, since you're having crashing problems or whatever. Um, I'm going to go ahead and recommend that you uh, update your NVIDIA drivers. I think the latest one is 280 uh, something. Also, you're going to want, I also overclock my graphics card. Um, it does bring it to a limit. Yes, there are dangers to overclocking, but um, not in this case, really. I mean, it's still a danger, but it's not that big a deal. I've been doing it for about, you know, six months now. It's not It's not a problem at all. Um, yeah, the latest driver is 280.26, I think, unless they came out with something else. I don't know. This will also help you with crashes. My computer did crash once in a while before when it was, like, 265, the driver version. So I uh, go ahead and overclock it. It helps it about either 5 to 10 frames. It also depends on the game, so, you know, yeah. Um, so, yeah, it shows a bunch of helpful tips and everything, so it's really easy to overclock. Um, I go ahead and, these are attached, these two right here. I go ahead and overclock mine to the core to 650, shader 1430, and then the memory, I do it at 900. You can set profiles, it's really easy. It's good. I put mine at about 900. Uh, this is pretty stable. Um, there's not much of a heat problem, really. Some people do, but I haven't had any problems with overheating at all. If you're, if it does reach to about 200, which I've never actually seen mine reach, then that's a big problem. Um, just tip, some tips for you. Um, so for my setup for Deus Ex, just go ahead and go to setup, or you can go in the game, I just find it easier right here. Um, I bump mine down two notches on the resolution, so it's 1280 by 800, and uh, that was just to make my uh, frame rate better because I was playing at like 25 to 20 because I was going out in the city and stuff. Now for some reason, I don't know if you're having this problem, but I have to have my a uh, my anti-aliasing um, at high. That's what the Steam that's what Steam set it to. I don't know why, but then I realized when I'm in the game, I'm like, oh, I want to turn that down. Um, it actually um, crashes when I try to launch the game. So make sure try this try these settings. I don't know if your uh, computer or Steam did this for the pre setup, but um, display ratio auto anti aliasing high, texture filtering tri tri linear uh, shadows normal, uh, SSA out normal, DOF normal, uh, enable VSync and post processing, and do not enable uh, triple buffering. Um, and there is no a um, not a um, DirectX 11 since these aren't uh, DX11 cards. So go turn it down a little bit. I don't remember if you had a 17 inch or a 15 inch. I, I can't honestly remember. And then um, you should be good to go from there. Um, I'm going to stop recording and go into the game to show you how it records because it uh, fraps will freeze. So. Okay, and this is the gameplay. I'm actually uh, running at perfect 30 frames per second. So at this point, I could really make a playthrough if I wanted to. Um, but do keep in mind that Fraps cuts it in half, so it does. If it does seem choppy, it's just Fraps. Uh, the gameplay is actually really good right now. Um, so yeah, make sure you have the settings. Make sure you have Nvidia uh, your graphics driver all the way up. Like I mean, not all the way up, but um, you have the latest version of it. Um, when I did have mine in like 265, I don't remember if I said it already. I did experience crashes in my computer. Like my whole computer just froze, and I had to force restart it, which isn't good for your computer. Um, so make sure you have that done. Oh my god. I don't know if this is still recording, but my computer just froze a little bit. That was weird. Actually, I've never experienced that before. Um, but it it auto corrected itself, so it's fine. Fine. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, make sure you got the drivers good, and I overclock a little bit to help the frame rate. So you should be good from there. Um, so yeah, I hope this helped a little bit.